2024 UK Open Pool Championship, another major ranking event organized by Matchroom, was absolutely special for several reasons. We could see a lot of controversy related to very difficult pockets with a record size of 3.9 inches, which caused huge problems for many players. Anyway, a lot of big names lost their chances very early. First of all, defending champion Eklund Kachi, SVB, Fedor Gorst, Josh Filler, and many others ended their hopes before semi-finals. In Final Four, we could find surprising matches where Mieszko Fortunski faced Petri Makunen and Robbie Capito battled with Pius Labutis. And actually, we could see very funny situation where Mieszko forgot that in semi-finals is raised to 11 and he celebrated too early after winning 10 frag. Anyway, big congratulations to Robbie who played the tournament of his life and he left in the defeated field Fedor Gors, Josh Filler and Mieszko after a very strong and nervous battle in the final match, who's fully deserved winning his first big ranking title. And we could see so many great shots and in this case I'm going to select top 20 and try to recreate all of them on my table as accurately as possible, with fewest possible attempts. As always, I will determine difficulty and recreation accuracy based on my observations and at the end I will choose the best shot of 2024 UK Open. So in this case, if you appreciate my work to make this video, then please consider leaving a thumbs up for me and hit the subscribe button to never miss videos like this. We need to start with this very aggressive and creative combination presented by Liu Ritang. And as you can see, I had some initial problems with very bad position of the cubo and needed to experiment with spin. But hopefully, I recreated the shot very quickly. Nineteenth place goes to this very confident pot and nice positioning by Josh Filler. And in my very first attempt, I found this perfect window for the cue ball to make position for the next ball. We need to see this nice opening of free ball by Fedor Gorst and this shot wasn't hard because I recreated it very quickly. Korean princess Seo Soa shows us this not easy pot with simultaneous precise positioning for the next ball. And once again, it wasn't a big problem for me because I recreated this shot with very high accuracy. Sixteenth place goes to Albino Shaw and this to a bank combo. And it didn't take me too much time to find this perfect spin and speed and pot both balls in one shot. We need to see this very long jump shot with precise positioning by James Aronas and once again hopefully I recreated this shot very quickly with very high precision. Another confident shot presented by Albino Shaw and I was very lucky because I executed this shot perfectly in my very first attempt. Thirteenth place goes to Kopini and this ultra thin cut with nice positioning and despite initial problems to hit free ball correctly, I recreated this shot with very lucky position for the next ball. We need to move forward to watch this nice bank shot by Mieszko Fortunski and this wasn't a big problem for me because I recreated this shot in my third attempt.
another nice jump shot presented this time by Robbie Capito. And potting two ball wasn't a problem for me, but I struggled to create position for the next ball, which took me some time. We need to open top 10 with this nice two rail kick shot by Robbie Capito, and I made it so fast in my second attempt. Ryuri Tang executed this very confident bank shot with simultaneous precise positioning. And in my third attempt, I found this perfect speed and spin to recreate this shot with very high accuracy. We need to watch this very confident kick shot by Pios Labutis, and due to uncomfortable position, I had some problems to hit the cubo, but despite this, I was able to recreate this shot in my 10th attempt. Sometimes spotting is not necessary, and this time Robbie Capito presented this very precise safety shot, which took me some initial problems to find correct speed and spin. But despite this, I found this perfect path for the cubo with very high accuracy in my seventh attempt. Let's move forward to see this very risky curve shot with winning combo presented by Nick Malai. And from this very uncomfortable position, I had huge problem to execute this shot correctly, but to my huge surprise, I recreated it very quickly in my sixth attempt. Fedor Gorst executed another beautiful jump with massive draw, and this shot was very uncomfortable for me to apply enough backspin to the cubo, but to my huge surprise, I found this perfect contact and recreated this shot already in my 8th attempt. Another beautiful jump shot executed this time by Anton Raga, and I thought it will be huge problem for me to make this shot accurately, but with touch of luck I recreated this shot in my fourth attempt. Third place and bronze medal in this episode goes to Albino Sean and this kick and stick. And as expected, I had problem to find correct speed and spin to hit two ball correctly, but after some very bad attempts, I hit a two ball bit to fin, but cue ball landed in safe position, what is acceptable. Second place and silver medal goes to this very long jump with touch or draw by Mickey Krause and I think it was impossible for me to apply so deep draw and I was able to only pot 2 ball without position for a free ball in my very first attempt. And finally, first place on the podium and the best shot of 2024 UK Open goes to this unbelievable and unforgettable free rail bank shot by Josh Filler. This shot was absolutely intended and as I expected, I had big problem to hit 8 ball correctly due to uncomfortable position of the cue ball, but after some very bad shots, I found this perfect path and recreated this shot in my 24th attempt.
I hope you enjoyed this episode with my classification of 20 best shot of 2024 UK Open and you will be able to leave a thumbs up for me and hit the subscribe button to never miss videos like this. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, leave your comment with your opinion about my classification and see you in the next video. Take care.